The first two weeks of 2024 have already been insane for Lucasfilm and Disney Star Wars as they got absolutely destroyed over the Ray movie. You know, the activist filmmaker Charmino Bay Chinoy and her comments in an interview about the upcoming movie. And of course, Daisy Ridley has also been making the rounds, giving interviews everywhere, promoting a different film. But of course, she's talking about Star Wars and talking about the Ray movie, the movie that nobody asked for, the movie that nobody wants, and the movie that continues to have problem after problem. If you recall, just before Disney Star Wars Celebration, they changed writers on that movie. They brought in Stephen Knight, and he was supposed to write the Ray movie, and then they attached Charmin Obeyed Chinoy to the project. Well, apparently, according to a new report, and I will preface this by saying... We have seen a multitude of reports over the past week. So much of it seems to be all about different chaos going on at Lucasfilm. And now, this is the thing that's making the rounds today. I already see different websites picking it up and running with it. Upcoming Ray Star Wars movie delayed indefinitely. That is the news. And it comes from World of Real. And I will say again, World of Real is not really known for these type of big breaking news stories at all. They even say that in there. They just said, hey, I had somebody reach out to me that told me this, and now it's off to the races with this news. Daisy Ridley is said to reprise her role as Rey Skywalker in Charmino Bechinoy's upcoming Star Wars film. We don't know how much about this movie, except for the controversial remarks its filmmaker has made and that it might be titled New Jedi Order. So I'm not really keen on looking for Star Wars intel, but a well-informed source is giving me additional details on the current status, and it's not good news. I've been told that it's been delayed indefinitely, which is why they surprised everyone last week and decided to announce The Mandalorian and Grogu as the next Star Wars movie. They just don't have confidence that New Jedi Order will be happening in the near future. The problems seem to reside in creative differences between screenwriter Stephen Knight and Lucasfilm. I'm told that a draft had originally been written for the film, but Lucasfilm gave him so many notes he had to start from scratch. Now, I'm going to stop it right there because if you remember, like I said, we've heard a multitude of rumors about this movie in the aftermath of the Mando movie, in the aftermath of some interview stuff. One of them was he hasn't even submitted a draft yet. Remember, that was going out, that there's been no script that was even submitted to Lucasfilm yet. If this rumor is true, then that rumor clearly is not. So what I'm saying is there's a lot of differing rumors out there and different reports from people. This one is catching a lot of people's eyes and is about to blow up within the next couple hours for sure. To make matters worse, there is the possibility that Knight might not be staying on board the project. His frustrations have grown, he's put Star Wars on the back burner, and is now focused on the screenplay for his Peaky Blinders movie, which is supposed to go in production for the fall. These issues with Knight come only two years after development on the film started, and various drafts have circulated with different writers, including Damon Lindelof and Justin Britt Gibson. They were the ones that were fired a few weeks or a few months before Disney Star Wars Celebration and replaced with Stephen Knight, and that's when the announcement was made at Celebration about the Ray movie with Charmino Bade Chinoy. Now again, just like every just like every one of these things that's come out over the past couple weeks, again, nothing, nothing, nothing for months and months and months until something big is in the news, a director makes a controversial statement, then all of a sudden somehow these people and their sources cards start coming out of the woodwork. So it should really be looked at with that kind of speculation. But considering everything we've seen from Lucasfilm, considering how many movies we've seen that have fallen apart, how many times writers have been fired, how many times directors have been fired, the idea idea that there's a bunch of chaos behind the scenes and that they may have just delayed the Ray movie indefinitely. It's pretty easy for most people to believe what an absolute shit show this is. And like I said, if this rumor report is to be believed then a lot of other ones that came out earlier in the week, that would mean that those are completely inaccurate in terms of no draft being turned in yet and things like that. The only thing that we can take as a sure bet with all the different Mandalorian and Grogu announcements, which, with what we've heard about the Ray movie, the only thing we can know for absolutely sure is that Lucasfilm is still an absolute disaster. The Kathleen Kennedy should have been fired ages ago, but it didn't happen. It is a mess, and Disney Star Wars just continues to get worse day after day. Let me know your thoughts about all this in the comments section below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.